What's up, nail friends? It's Sarah here. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a haul. I've gathered a bunch of stuff over the past few months while I was pregnant, and I've just been waiting to do a video to share it with you guys. So that's what we are doing today. If you're interested in that, just keep watching. Okay, so I obviously have my baby. Um, he is napping right now, so hopefully I can get this video filmed. Okay, so let's start with the first thing. So I bought um, on Amazon a bunch of these. So it is this. So you guys know I have these back here, which have all my gel polishes, which look so cute and good, but um, these are six rows. And then I saw that Talia had this, and this one is seven rows. And so I could get, if I have four of them, I think I could have like, what, 28 more, 28 more polishes. I'm gonna build all the other boxes here soon and then redo this. And then I'll show you guys a close up of that and how it looks, adding the extra layer of gel polish. The next thing I got is this big box right here. Um, this is for crystals. And everything that I have in this video, I'll make sure to link in my description box. So make sure you check there if you're interested in anything that I'm gonna show you guys. So this is a little drawer thing that someone posted on Talia's Nail Tales YouTube group and she put crystals in it. So I thought that that would look really good. It would take up empty some space inside my drawers here so I can add other stuff in there. I can put all the crystals in here so I can see them and then display them in my room. So I will do that and show you guys a close up of what that looks like. Okay, and that's how that looks in my background and kind of just tells me I have room to buy more crystals. I have room to grow. <laughs> okay, next we have this. So I will put this together and do like a overlay video of what it looks like. But basically you put the slots in and you use it to add all your leftover nail art and the nail designs. You can look at it, it's a little classier. Something you can display out in the open. And I found this from Liquid Chrome. She posted it on her YouTube channel, but she got the white one and I was way too impatient to wait, so I got the black one. But it's funny, because I've had this for like months now and I totally could have waited because I assumed I was gonna do the video while I was pregnant, but when I was pregnant, I just had zero energy to film. <laughs> Up next, we have this. Okay, like I said, I've ordered things like months ago, so I don't even remember what a lot of this stuff is. Really big bag for, for this. So what is in here? Oh my God, more stuff to go through. <laughs> Ooh, you guys are gonna like this. This is a sparkling crystal dish. So you guys know I love these dishes. This one is kind of like on a stand, super, super pretty and like my other ones, but got a stand on it. So we'll see how that works out. I'll let you guys know if I can remember how I like this stand in uh, the next video or a video that I use. I'll try to use it next time I'm filming. Okay, so there's another box that's shaped like that. So I'm guessing I got another dish like that. This one isn't usable. Weird. I'll show you guys. Okay, so I thought this was gonna be like this one. You can see it has this like a round ball in it, so you can't really do anything with it. Um, this is really pretty though. Uh, I don't know what you could use this for though. It's kind of like a decoration. So I have another nailer down here. Oh yeah. So what these are, again, I got this idea from Liquid Chrome Nails. I will link her uh, YouTube channel down below. So make sure you go check her out. But she got these and put them on her glitter balls uh, gel polishes. So the top of them had the color. And I want to do that so that I can have it color organized. It'll just be a little bit easier when I'm doing like videos and stuff. So everything's about making things easier. So I'll just show you guys quickly what these look like. And then if I get them done before this video goes up, I'll show you what that looks like too. So we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. They're like dots that you paint and put on the lids. Kind of like a mini swatch. So I think that's pretty cool. And I got a whole load of them. 
So I'll link that down below as well. Next Amazon thing. This is kind of like a Dappen dish, but it I got two of them. So this is the second one. I've already been using the other one. So I can tell you guys how I feel about this dish. So it's cute and it looks good in your background, but it leaks because the edges are really low. So when you're pouring it, it leaks and your brush doesn't get held in this well. So unless you want to be cleaning up monomer off your desk, I don't really recommend these, but it would be cute to use for water or blending fluid if you're doing like art inks or stuff like that. So, I mean, you still can get it, but don't use it for monomers. It's really inconvenient. I'm like, what is this? There's this little box with these little boxes in it. I literally have no idea. Oh. Okay, so I guess I got these tiny <laughs> dishes. I thought these would be bigger. Oh my god. There's like a little heart with a lid. Oh my god. Well, I guess I can use that for glitter or something. Oops. Okay, and I can hear Theodore fussing, so I'm just gonna go check on him and then hopefully I can finish filming this video for you guys today. But I'll be back. Okay, I'm back. I got this nail drill bit holder, and the reason I got this was because it's just kind of not really working with what I have now, and it's kind of messy. So I thought that this would be cleaner and look a little nicer. Um, okay, so I got this gift from Kelsey's Claws. I did a little TikTok of it. If you guys saw my TikTok, I'll just show you guys kind of a close up of what it looks like. She creates these hand uh, made custom resin palettes and this one has my logo on it. Um, so that's so cool and my favorite color is green. I especially love emerald green like this So that's why she made it green and I actually have two already of these the one that looks like my dog Benny actually I should show you guys <laughs> So she made this for me. This one looks like my dog Benny and then this one is Princess Jasmine and now I have my own logo, so I really like that. That's what that looks like um, and then she made me this brush holder so it is a heart and then so you take your brush and you just stick it on like that so your brush is just not touching the desk and it's really cute so she makes these in all different colors and stuff the next thing she made was this custom made um monitor dish like so cool hey so after you use it, you just wipe it out with alcohol and it, so it should stay looking like this. Isn't that so cool? So she, so you guys know I love the lotus flowers, right? So she made one out of resin, so that's pretty cool. So I will link her Instagram and you guys can check her out down below. She's, that's my Amazon haul. So I have some stuff to show you guys from my site, Nail Throne. Okay, some stuff we got into the Nail Throne from Glitter Bells is the C. 19 Pro Multi Surface Sanitizer Spray. I don't think it really smells like anything. <laughs> yeah, and it's uh, safe on skin, safe on surface. This is great if you work in a salon setting so you can spray your door handles after your clients come and go and easy cleanup. So we have that is new. And then we also have in the Sanitizer Spray Disinfectant. So you can use this spray on your client's hands and nails or you can spray it on your station to clean up. And then also from Glitterals, we have in the Diamond Shine Cleanser, so you would use this to cleanse off a gel top coat, like your rubber top coat. So that's what we also have in as well. Okay, something else we got in are the new Starburst glitters. So they have six, or yeah, six. And so we got these in stock right now. So if you guys have been looking and waiting for these, we have them in stock they are super super pretty i'm just gonna do some glitter smears quickly i'm so excited to look at these and pull them into my collection and show you guys what they look like i'm just gonna be using my glitter balls clear monomer to do these smears the brush i'm using is the glitter balls pastel brush number 10. this is called juicy stardust so like i said all of these are super super pretty you can't really tell when you open the light but We'll swatch and you'll see. So it's like a light pastel glitter, kind of see-through. But when you swatch it down, it has so much glitter in it. Do you guys see that? 
Wow, that's so pretty. Even has little like moon shapes. So it's got butterflies, hearts, moons, stars. So pretty. So that one was the Juicy Starburst Dust, which is kind of like an orangey color. Next one I wanted to show you guys is the Aqua Stardust. So these are just the travel lids. You can just throw them away. So again, full of all that glitter. So beautiful. But this one has like that aqua color base. You can see all the stars and hearts. Look at that. Wow. Butterflies. Wow. So pretty. The next one is called Beauty Stardust. This one is a pink. Wow, that is so pretty. All of these are stunning. So that's what that looks like. It is called Minty Stardust. So this one's a green. Wow. Ooh, pretty. And again, full of all that glitter goodness. Next up is Coral Stardust. So this one is a pink, but it's more like a corally pink, brighter than the Beauty Stardust. And then the last one is called Sunny Stardust. So it's kind of like a yellow, actually quite bright yellow. Okay, and here's how all those look. Wow, they're so pretty. So I'm so glad I got these into my collection. So we have these on site, which is naildrone.com. So I will link these down below. So also, we are getting in very soon the unbelievable gels and the new glitters. These are coming in stock soon. Make sure you guys sign up on the website. There is a pop-up that pops up on the screen and you wanna sign up with your email and then we will email you guys when new product comes in. I hope you guys enjoyed this little video. Um, if you did, make sure you give me a thumbs up. So thanks so much for watching guys. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.